Okay. Are you guys ready? All right, I have my own clock. Are we just going to sync up? Yep. All right, hold on. I'll just start mine when you go, and you can use yours. All right. Yes. It's praying to the Lord. Are you guys ready? Okay. Speak. You got to shout. All right, I'm starting in three. Five, four, three, two. One, go. All right, good morning, good morning. Hey, real, real quick, before you guys have a seat, I got a confession to make. The music is really loud in here. If you think that the music is loud, go ahead and raise your hand so I know that you're with me. Um, yeah, and I think that the people in my row, they're probably really happy that the music is loud too, because I can't sing. So they're really glad that the music is loud in here. So, hey, go ahead and have a seat. And on the way to your seat, go ahead and tell your neighbor, the music is loud in here. The music is loud in here. Well, hey, good morning, Elevation Church, Morrisville. My name is Claude Thomas. I am the youth director here at this location. Um, and usually I'm in the back running around with your kids and I'm watching them learn about Jesus. Um, but this morning I got the opportunity uh, to meet a lot of new faces. Uh, and speaking of new faces, church, why don't we give it up and welcome all of our VIPs, all of our first time guests. Um, we want you guys to know that we have prayed for you. We have prepared for you. Uh, we're believing that the seat that you're in right now is the very seat that God uh, had for you. Um, and we're believing that this morning, God's going to do some amazing things uh, in your life. So on the way into the worship experience, you should have received a worship guide. Um, and at the bottom of that worship guide, go ahead and fill that connection card out and take it to the black tent. Uh, we would love to give you a gift on behalf of Pastor Stephen uh, and Holly. Um, but during the next worship song, my favorite part of the worship experience, um, we get to give our tithes and our offerings. Um, yeah, and you, you may hear some people celebrating. You may hear some people clapping. Um, and you're like, what's so good about, you know, giving? What's so good about giving my money away? Um, I think I know why. So um, in Psalm 68, 5, it says, a father to the fatherless, a widow, uh, a defender of widows, uh, is God in his holy dwelling. And you're probably like, Claude, what's so good about that Bible verse? There's nothing talking about money. I don't hear anything about tithes and offering. Um, well, this past weekend, uh, the staff and I, we got a chance to go to the Dream Center here in Raleigh, North Carolina. Yeah. Um, and it's an orphanage for young boys. And these are young boys who don't have fathers. Um, and we got a chance to hang out with the guys and play games with them. And we got a chance to eat with them. And I noticed a young man named Isaiah. And Isaiah was off on his own and you know, he was kind of doing his own thing, didn't really want to be bothered. Um, and Isaiah and I started talking, and he had a really great spirit about him. And I started talking to him, and Isaiah's like, and I'm like, Isaiah, what's wrong, man? Why are you so upset? And Isaiah tells me um, that he doesn't have school clothes. Um, he's getting ready to go to the sixth grade, and we all know that uh, the transition from elementary school to middle school is super important. Uh, he was telling me that he didn't have the supplies that he needed. He didn't have shoes, and he didn't have clothes. Um, well, Elevation Church Morrisville, I want you guys to know that because of your generosity, because of your, of your giving, uh, because of your tithes and offering, we were able to bless Isaiah with all the school supplies that he's going to need uh, for sixth grade, all the shoes, on the all the clothes that he's going to need. Um, and Isaiah may not have a, an earthly father to provide those things for him. He may not have an earthly father in his life. Uh, but because of your generosity, because of your giving, Isaiah knows that there's a heavenly father who's going to provide and meet all of his needs. Um, so you say, man, Claude, how do I get involved? How do I start giving? Well, on the screen behind me, there's plenty of ways where you can um, figure out how to give and which option works best for you. Uh, but for myself, I'm always on my phone. I'm always going through Instagram and social media and Facebook. Um, so personally, I use the Elevation app and I used to give um, that way. Uh, that way I'm able to take my phone out and I'm able to do some amazing things. Um, and another thing that I like about giving is we have Love Week coming up. And Love Week is our huge outreach event um, we give back 12% of everything that we take in uh, during the year, and we're able to go out and bless our community. Um, well, Elevation Church, Morrisville, uh, we have baptisms coming up from our University City location. We're going to watch Donovan take a step of faith. So why don't you guys get up on your feet? Why don't you guys start celebrating as we head to our University <laughs> Awesome. Thank you, Claude. Um, what level of awkwardness do you think was added to this experience for you because it was on a camera in a room by yourself? It was super awkward, man. I'm not even going to lie. <laughs> um, 
just take a stab at like 